Hello students now we will be solving memory based questions of gate 19 for more video solution on gate 19 subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click bell icon for instant notification Hello friends my name is Pranshu Mahajan and uh, in this video we are going to discuss a question from heat transfer particularly belonging to steady state heat conduction So the question says one dimensional steady state heat conduction so let us assume that dimension to be x takes place through a solid whose cross sectional area varies linearly in the direction of heat transfer so basically a that is the area of cross section it is a linear function of x assume that there is no internal heat generation rate in the solid so basically q dot g is equal to 0 and thermal conductivity of the material is constant and independent of temperature so your k is a constant it is not a function of x what is the temperature distribution in the solid and uh, four options are given linear parabolic uh, exponential and logarithmic so let's solve the question and obviously this question will be based on heat conduction equation okay so i think generalized heat conduction equation for one dimension it is generally written like this del square d by del x square plus q dot g upon k is equal to Rho, uh, rho c upon k del t by del t. I hope all of you are aware of this generalized heat conduction equation, where t is the temperature, x is the x dimension, uh, rho is the density of material, c is the specific heat, k is the thermal conductivity of material, and q dot g that is the internal heat generation rate. Now, based on our conditions, q dot g is equal to zero, and since we are talking of steady state system, this these terms will be zero. So you are directly left with del square t by del x square equal to zero. But there is a catch in this. This heat conduction equation is for those solids which have uniform area of cross section, right? Is that right? But when you talk of non-uniform area of cross section, the heat conduction equation will be written like d by dx of area into dt by dx, right? So this is your heat conduction equation for non-uniform cross section. Now derivative of something is zero, so that something will be a constant. So your a dt by dx that is going to be a constant. Now you can take your a on the other side, and definitely a is a linear function of x, which is given in the question. So let me write it as a linear function a x plus b. Now if you use the variable separable form, your dx will go on the other side. Now derivative. I think you will get a logarithmic function, right? Log log of a x plus b. So, what is your temperature profile? T as a function of x. That is a logarithmic function. So, the correct answer is logarithmic. This is your correct answer. So, I hope you like the solution and uh, please uh, like the solution, like the video and share the video with your friends also. Maybe it will help them in understanding these solutions. Thank you.